Hi everyone. In this video, we'll walk you through the Contentful web app and highlight five main areas developers should be aware of. We'll be using our colorful lifestyle demo, which is a full-blown fictitious e-commerce website. This example is perfect to showcase the web app setup and options, mimicking real-life approaches taken by some of our customers. Let's go behind the scenes. We're now in the Contentful web app. The first area to be aware of is your organization settings. We'll click on the organization name in the top left corner and select Organization Settings and Subscriptions. We landed on the Subscription tab with a high-level overview. To get your organization ID or change the name, go to the Organization Information tab. To view your organization usage with the number of API requests and asset bandwidth, select the Usage tab. The next page is for adding and managing individual users. This is where you can invite users to join the organization. The second area we want to show you is where to create custom apps. Under the Organization Apps page, you can create custom private apps built by you for your specific organization's needs. It is fully under your control and not accessible by other organizations. Private apps created within your organization can then be installed in your space. We also have a great list of public apps, many of them open source, available in our marketplace. Check them out. Use them to connect Contentful with other systems to assemble the stack of your choice. The third area is your space and environment settings. To access these settings, make sure that you're in the right space. To locate your space ID, go to General Settings. Each space comes with a default master environment. To add more environments, go to Environments. To generate access tokens to retrieve or store content with Contentful, go to API Keys. Next are Managing Webhooks, where you can add and then manage webhooks in your space. Webhooks can be useful to automate your processes and receive notifications on content changes. We have a set of webhook templates available for you, or you can create your own. And for info on space and environment usage, go to Usage. The fourth area is your personal user account settings. This is where you can see which spaces and organizations you belong to by clicking on those tabs. Tokens and OAuth applications have your management authentication information, such as OAuth applications, OAuth tokens, and personal access tokens. The last area we'll cover is where to look for resources, help, and support. For resources, click on the question mark next to your user icon. We have links to the Help Center, Developer Docs, and our training courses. And if you click on your user avatar and then Get Support, you'll be taken to our support page. These five main areas of the Contentful web app should help you get started developing with Contentful.